After the mobile agent opens the Dynamics mobile application and logs in with his credentials, he will be presented with the home screen, where he can see information regarding the route for the day and the planned visits that he has to take. From the bottom, he has an inventory tab where he can initiate to load up his vehicle or to unload it, and he can see system information with general settings, the option to connect to Bluetooth printers, and to change the theme. Once he starts the route, the system will make calculations and uh, perform synchronizations to collect information from the server regarding inventory levels, discounts, customers and prices. He will be presented with the route of the day in and the order of the customers that he needs to visit. From the top, he has a filter where he can cycle between pending customers and already visited. From the bottom right, he has a map icon, he can click on that button and the best possible route between customers will be presented. From the orange button on the bottom left, he can cycle between the different stops and on the bottom, the system will provide information of the distance between the customers and the duration of the travel. That uh, map can be accessed all the time. Once we go back into the route, from the bottom left, we can see in route customers and on the right, you can see all customers available in order for him to perform out of route visits as well. Saying that we are ready to proceed and visit the first customer, we can click on the green shop. And once we select the customer, we'll see some more quick tasks that we can perform be be before we actually begin our visit. We can see customer history, see what the customer has ordered in the past, favorite products. We can perform a reschedule. Uh, if our customer is not able to see us right now, we can see plan visits for other days or if this is reoccurring visits and we can set that up in the system. We can perform a skip for us to declare why we are not able to visit the customer right now. Or if we wish, we can set up a new GPS location with pinpoint accuracy. This can be also performed as a task or it can be optional. From the bottom, we have several tabs in terms of to see if this customer is part of any campaigns. We can see contact information as emails, websites, addresses and phone numbers. And in the tab others, we can see financial information such as credit limits, credit balance, type of payment that this customer prefers. On the far right, we can see notes where we can place uh, uh, notes regarding our, our client, like obtaining uh, store manager signatures, collecting outstanding payments and others. Once we are ready to begin our visit, we can click on the green play icon from the bottom right and we can begin our visit. We will be presented with the visit confirmation window where we can see that we have a maximum visit duration of 30 minutes for this particular client. We will see the address and we will see on the map where are we in correspondence to the address that we have. This is our physical location. Currently, we can display that. We click on the green play icon and we can begin our visit.